I am Anurag Tripathi. I am a faculty member in the Department of Physics at IIT Hyderabad. And I will be taking this course on Introduction to Classical Mechanics, which will run for 12 weeks. Okay? You will get weekly assignments and there will be an exam at the end, which you can choose to take or choose not to take. So, here is a, a list of, a brief list of things that I am planning to prepare, um, planning to cover in this course. So, of course, we are going to start with Euler-Lagrange equations. Okay, and uh, which are the equations of motion? Okay, and after that, we are going to discuss about symmetries in quite detail, and these symmetries are extremely important to understand uh, the nature around us. They uh, they make the appreciation of what is happening around us easier and better. And um, after that, I am going to discuss about oscillations in detail. Okay, so that is the. next um, thing that will be covered oscillations and I had symmetries before that. Now, oscillations is quite an important topic and um, I would encourage you to uh, learn it um, properly and after that we will have a discussion on two body problem and then we will move on to rigid body motion. Okay? So, after two body problem, we will move on to rigid body motion. Okay. So, here we will learn how a top, uh, what kind of motion a top executes and uh, we will um, take up different kinds of tops. Okay. Top means let two. And then uh, we are going to do Hamiltonian mechanics. Okay, and that is where the course will end. And as you can see that um, I am not going to cover everything that should be covered in a course which is meant for master's student. Okay, but uh, given the time I have for this course, these are um, the important things that I can cover. But of course, I will give you a list of books that you can follow to cover the remaining topics. Okay. Now, if you find this course tough, which many of you can find, uh, do not give up easily. Okay? It usually, things get better with time and after you have spent some time working things out. And um, I will encourage you to ask questions in the forum. Okay? You will have a, a forum where you, you can ask questions and I will be very happy and the TAs will be very happy to answer your questions. And of course, you can also discuss among among the other uh, fellow learners. Okay, um, ask these questions even if you think that they are silly, because what you think is a silly may not necessarily be a silly question, and uh, you just ask without worrying about it. And uh, yeah, as I said, there will be an exam at the end, and I will encourage you to take the exam because that puts some pressure on you that you have to you know, work hard to clear that exam. But of course, if you choose, you can leave it out. And I um, do hope that you enjoy this course and learning the subject. <laughs>